Okay, let's have a look around this um, 2004 um, BMW M3 convertible, six-speed manual. Uh, finished in carbon black with full black Nappa leather interior. The, uh, the high quality black leather. Um, 19 inch alloys. Um, very, very high spec car this one. It's got uh, factory sat nav, TV, so the Nappa leather and pretty much every extra you could, um, you could really wish for. Uh, certainly all of the, um, there's no blank buttons anywhere. It's all, um, all as it should be. So someone spent a lot of money on, uh, on options when it was new, I think. And it's in very nice shape. It's done, I think, 94,000 miles from memory. And so it's got an M3 number plate on it, which will come with the car. Go around and pick out some good bits and bad bits. Walking around the body and giving it a clean earlier on. All the panel lines seem to be very straight. Um, I can't find much in the way of dinks and scratches and stuff. Obviously the front spoiler is quite, um, quite stone chipped, especially around the lower edges. Um, the bonnet isn't too badly chipped actually. One or two sort of minor chips just on the front of the bonnet here. But otherwise pretty good. Looking down the near side, it all looks very straight and parking dink free and everything down there. It's all good. And again, all the shut lines are all as they should be. It's just a bit of polish. Um, just recently had new brakes on it, front and rear. You can see they're proper uh, vented and drilled discs. They've just been replaced to both ends. Uh, the screen is fine. Obviously the hood is good. Um, I've got the hood down there so I can show you the interior, but uh, the hood is good. You'll see it in the photos. I'm going to go that far. Um, passenger door is all fine. Obviously in here... Oh, press, the, press the button. That's it. Um, yeah, just again. <laughs> it's got the security locks on it. Um, all the interior is all in good shape. The passenger door um, trim here is a bit worn and scuffed from obviously from rings or something like that. But otherwise the leather's all in uh, all in nice order. Dash is all there and all nice. The ashtray lid again is a bit um, a bit marked and stuff, but again probably from. Uh, rings and things like that. Near side rear wing is all fine. There is a bit of curbing on the especially on the near side alloys. Have a look at the offside ones in a minute. Both the near side alloys are a bit curbed. But the only sort of body issue I can find is a very 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 slight scuff just on the back of the offside of the near side rear arch just there. Very slight scuff. But just a it's only about so long. Um, around the tail end it's all as it should be there sticker on the boot lid but uh, I'm sure that'll come off if you wanted to. Boot lid's all good. There's no big scratches on it anywhere really. Down the offside all looks pretty, again pretty straight and clean and correct. Again the offside wheels are a little bit curbed on the rims. Um, I think that's probably part of the course of one of these. Uh, here slight blemish Tiny, tiny, two tiny blemishes just there in the offside rear wing, which yeah, no, they're in the, in the paint. Two tiny blemishes in the paint just there. Um, offside door is all good, and there's two. I noticed these earlier on. Looks like it's been touched in. A couple of tiny paint chips just there on the offside front wing have just been touched in a little bit. Um, but otherwise, it's all nice there. And again inside. Driver's door's all nice. Um, it's a bit grubby in the footwell, just from my boots. It's such a nasty uh, rainy day here today for a chance. For, for, for once we've got the roof down, but I suspect I'm going to have to put it straight back up again in a minute. It's going to rain again. Um, driver's seat, slightly scuffed on the outer bolster, as you'd expect, but no more than that. Certainly hasn't gone through or anything. That's done 94,000 miles after all, but uh, the condition of the interior is commensurate with that. Little tiny bit of stitching just coming apart there on the, um, on the side bolster. But uh, that's about your lot. That's it, I think. My name's Simon. You can reach me on 0771 906 9353 or in the office on 0118 946 3352 or you can go to our website, which is www.motodrome.co.uk. We take part exchanges. We take Visa and MasterCard credit cards and debit cards with a 2% surcharge for credit cards. And we can obviously uh, deliver it anywhere you like. That's about it. And 